Hey guys, what's going on and welcome back to another spooky video. That's right guys, today I am matching my chair. Can you believe this? I mean, <laughs> twins. But that's not what we're here to talk about guys. If you are new here, please subscribe with the notification bell on. We're on the road to 158,000 subscribers and I would love you to join me on this journey. So hit subscribe and join the fam. And before I forget guys, Tina wanted me to say hi to you all from her. Uh, she knows she hasn't posted on YouTube for like a year, <laughs> but she may come back one day. Um, she's just, you know, she's doing her own thing and stuff like that right now, and I'm really proud of her. Um, God, I love that girl. I just love her. But yeah, she just wanted me to let you guys know that she said hi, and uh, she hopes you guys are doing well, and she's also doing very well too. But anyway, guys, I have an awesome video for you today. This one is actually pretty creepy, and I mean, there is pictures that I'm going to show you guys from baby monitors, which is freaking terrifying. Do you remember my video yesterday how I told you guys kids are scary? Like this video will prove that. So today we're going to be taking a look at a bunch of stories and pictures in this one video of people's experiences with baby monitors. So it says right here, creepy baby monitor horror stories and photos and parents, about parents I mean, who hear and see strange, creepy, un unexplainable things on their children's baby monitors. But enough of the jibber jabber, let's jump right over to the stories. Number one, a father was sitting on the couch reading the newspaper. His newborn baby was upstairs asleep in her crib. On the baby monitor, he could hear the sound of his wife singing a lullaby. Go to sleep, go to sleep. He smiled. Just then, the front door opened and his wife came inside, carrying the groceries. Number two, there's nothing in the world more soothing than the laughter of a baby, unless it's 1 a.m. and you're home alone, and you don't have a baby. Number three, my cousin woke up in the middle of the night looked at the baby monitor and saw this. Number four, I had a baby monitor with a camera installed at the foot of my son's crib. One evening, I was downstairs watching a movie when I happened to glance over at the monitor. All I could see on the screen was an eerie, distorted face. I ran upstairs to my son's room and found him sound asleep. I looked around, but didn't see anything strange. So I waited in the hallway and peeked in through a crack in the door. About 10 minutes later, I saw my son standing up in his crib and putting his face right up against the monitor. He was giggling like crazy. Then he quickly lay down and acted like he was asleep. I laughed it off, but a few nights later, I saw the same thing on the monitor. The only difference was my son was lying on the couch next to me at the time. Number five, my wife and I woke up to this on the baby monitor. Number six, my baby was six months old and she had been asleep for about an hour when the monitor started picking up static. My husband and I just stared at it for a moment. Then a voice came through the monitor, a low, husky voice that gave us chills. It said, get her. We both ran down the hall and into the bedroom where the baby was. Just as we went into the room, the baby's blanket literally flew off as if someone had pulled it off of her. My husband grabbed the baby and we ran out of the room. The whole house was so cold, we could see our own breath. We got into the car and spent the night at my mother-in-law's house. Number seven, 
Not sure why your cousin was freaked out by their baby monitor. This is what shows up on mine every night. Number 8. Years ago, I worked with radios. One day, during a test, I picked up a two-way baby monitor in a nearby apartment. I could hear a baby sleeping and the sound of some woman washing the dishes. As a joke, I pushed talk on my headset and said in a loud demonic voice, Feed me. Then I heard the sound of dishes shattering. Number 9. Living with a little baby is like being in a horror movie. American Horror Story 5. Our Baby Monitor. Number 10. We had a baby monitor with night vision mode, so we could watch our son sleeping in his crib. One evening, I looked over at the monitor and saw my son standing up. Then, I saw two female hands reach in and pick him up. I completely flipped out and made my husband go upstairs to check on him. The baby was lying there, sleeping peacefully, and there was no ghostly woman. I couldn't figure out what was going on. Then I heard the neighbor's dogs barking, but I heard it on our baby monitor. I finally realized that the neighbors had the exact same baby monitor as us, and we were picking up footage of their son's room. Number 11. Since we're doing scary baby monitor pics. Number 12. I was babysitting my niece once, and I could see her on the baby monitor. All of a sudden, I heard some whispering and realized it was coming from the baby monitor. When I looked at the screen, there was a dark shadow near her crib. The shadow definitely hadn't been there before. I have never been more terrified in my life. I ran upstairs to her room and looked around, but there was nothing there. And when I went back downstairs and looked at the monitor, the shadow was gone. I told my brother about it, and he pulled me aside and told me not to mention it to his wife because she would freak out. He said that he had seen the same thing several times and heard the same whispering. They stayed in the house for four more years, and my niece would often tell her mom about her imaginary friend who talked to her at night. To this day, it still creeps me out. Number 13. My dad told me, one time, when I was 18 months old, I stood up in the crib and ordered a Happy Meal, fries, and a medium Coke from the baby monitor. Wow, okay, so some of those were pretty creepy. Some of them were kind of funny. I mean, that last one, what the heck was that? I don't even feel like that belongs in here. It was such a mood killer. Like the little 16-month-old baby, which, by the way, I don't know why people say that. Just say it's one. It's one. It's not... It's, I hate that. Like, it's more annoying when the baby's, like, two, and people still say, Oh, he's 24 months old. He's fucking two, goddammit. Just use two. It's so much easier. But anyway, that's one of my pet peeves, but we're not talking about that today. Yeah, I just feel like that last one was kind of silly and kind of funny at the same time, and it was kind of a mood killer. I mean, some of these were pretty creepy, and this last one just kind of, I don't know. I mean, it's like, I was just imagining being asleep, and then you wake up, and then suddenly you just see the baby there on the monitor, like, Hey, can I get a Happy Meal with a large fries and a large soda, please? Like, that would be so funny, but also dumb. <laughs> but there was a couple in there, like, that one with the shadow totally reminded me of Insidious. In that one scene where the mom is, like, downstairs playing the piano, and then the baby monitor is, like, hearing voices, and she goes over to, like, the stairs, and she's listening, and then it's, like, yelling at the baby. Um, and then she runs up the stairs, and he's, like, standing there in the, in the bedroom. Oh, that's freaking scary, man. I love Insidious so much. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed these spooky stories. And let me know in the comment section, have you ever had a scary experience with, like, a, 
a baby monitor like has it been you yourself do you have kids and that's happened to you or like i would love to know what your stories are in the comment section below and guys if you enjoyed this video make sure you drop a big fat juicy like on it i would really appreciate that it really helps out my videos a lot and i will see you back here in the next video remember the most important thing chase your dreams and keep on fighting peace out guys Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoy my videos and you would like to support me and my channel more and also be featured in my videos, go check out my Patreon. Link is in the description. I would really appreciate any help you guys have to offer. As you can see, we have different tiers, different rewards. So go over there, check it out. And uh, I would really appreciate that. Every little helps. Thank you so much. And also guys, don't forget to subscribe with the notification bell on and also follow me on all my social media. I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Snapchat. So go follow Follow me on all of those and remember the most important thing, I love you guys and chase your dreams.